Hey guys, pretty excited to be bringing you the first video with the new Meyer trail cameras. We uh, got them in yesterday and had a minute to start setting up the um, the X Vision, which is their uh, cell cam, and uh, got some video and some tips coming on that how to get that set up uh, properly. Some things that we learned here right off the bat. But this uh, little machine right here, and you can tell we're on the ho house farm here, testing the first ones out. This little machine here, I think, is going to be um, a pretty valuable tool in our arsenal here. Um, this this one is the HL2, the Hit Lister 2, and as far as excuse me, as far as everything looks right now, is the fit and finish the uh, trail camera is me is meeting all of the my expectations and if you guys know me at all on a personal level outside of the the world of the uh, videos here you'll know that i'm i'm a i'm a critic on these um cameras and there's just so much out there right now that is um just not up to par and i'm, I'm just gonna use the word junk um is a lot of time a lot of money invested into these things especially from this time on as they are are as a hunter they're a very critical tool, and um, to have um, junk hanging on the tr on the tree doesn't do us a lot of good over time. And uh, so that's why we've, uh, you know, for about five years here now, I've been really struggling. Um, had a bunch of cameras um, back to back out of a dozen cameras I was using, like four or five cameras, two years shut down on me right in the middle of October, and uh, was not happy about that. And no customer service to back them. And now switching to the Meyer cameras, I really think, uh, you know, a, a Midwestern company here, I really think that we have found the missing link, if you will, into the uh, next step of the trail cameras here. So um, as you can see, like we were talking, this is the hit list too. And as you can see my hand, I mean, if I could switch the phone here, the camera to it, it's about, it's, uh, you know, it's a little bit uh, bigger than half the size of my, um, you know, my uh, phone. So I love the way that it fits to the tree. It's this dark brown. It looks good. Um, the strap is one of the things I really liked about this. It sounds really simple, but um, the strap is uh, about twice as long. Next time I, I mount one on a tree, I'll have to show you. It's about twice as long as a normal strap. So to me, I'd rather have the camera on the right tree uh, or in the right spot, not necessarily always the right tree. And uh, I ran into that, you know, multiple different times where it's like, okay, I got to move things just a little bit because the camera was either, you know, the straps that they supply aren't going to fit it or, or the bungee cords that come with them. And this year, I don't know exactly what size tree that will fit around, but I'm thinking probably, you know, 28 inches or something. It's a, it's a huge strap. Um, you just got some little bit of extra that you got to tuck away, but I like, I don't know, tying them up anyway. So you can see the backside of the camera. I always make sure I tuck that stuff in there. Um, but as far as the camera, it's got three uh, quick sets on it. So you have easy one, easy two, easy three. So one, one and two are the photos. Easy three is a quick set, 10 second video. And um, easy go through on the uh, display here. I set it up in just a couple of minutes. And uh, the the uh, cell cam did take a little bit longer. And But that was, you know, some of my my issues and we'll be bringing you one of these on the x-vision as well but as far as um this one here is your standard uh you know sd card pop the card in it and went down and and um set the time and the date in and took me longer to walk to the tree than it did set the camera up and we you know as hunters we like that um so we are going to flip this on obviously this is one of my uh video uh, cameras so we're going to set this down into the setup um the setup mode and uh, once it runs through its 30 second cycle it gives you 30 seconds to kind of get all your stuff done and and uh get out of there i guess you could say and once that's once that's done it has the battery life um you know 100 percent on the batteries it's got how many videos that we've got going and it's got 10 seconds left on the countdown so we're going to shut the door on this for the first time, and we're going to bring you some footage here shortly. Um, maybe we'll stop and pull the card even tomorrow just to see, and we're going to you know, take a look at some quality of some video here. But I think, guys, that we have found our, finally have found our cameras just by putting the hands on them. I mean, they're, they're just 
the fit and finish of this camera is unbelievable. Here's the licking branch. Here's the camera. Meyer Trail Camera 2020. And uh, new venture here, a new partnership. And I think it's what we've been looking for 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 all these uh, all these years struggling with the, the ever so important camera. And it's just a new world 20 years ago. Uh, we did everything without them. Now I wouldn't be in the woods you know, without them. So um, we're going to be bringing you a lot of, hopefully a lot of cool footage here with these cameras. But uh, Meyer camera, I'll put the link in here and stuff to it. Guys, check them out. They've been great to us so far today, struggling with some stuff. Exactly, you know, I'm kind of finicky. Probably wouldn't have taken the normal guy with that, but I wanted to make sure it was right about all my settings and stuff on the cell cam and, and be hanging that on the new farm tomorrow. And uh, other than that, we're... Uh, we're off and running, and and uh, I believe this is the like I said, I believe this is the link that we've been we've been looking for, and looking forward to bringing you guys some some quality uh, images and and uh, video. Thanks, guys.